Kia ora te whanau, ko waro toku unga. My whole theme for the day is to shadow the boys and just really kind of capture the whole moment for them. It's their first event, it's going to be a big deal, so it's going to be really, really good. Come along and join us. Hey, it's okay, it's finally come down to this moment. How are you both feeling? Let's start with you, Jackson. Frickin' nervous, but I'm looking forward to it. Going to yeah. have some fun. I'm nervous, excited, scared, but let's do it. It's going to be a banger day, man. I mean, we've already done the course before, so we know what's coming up. Unlike uh, the bro. <laughs> Mate, what happened like yesterday? Well, you know, the crowd needed entertaining, so... Clearly, <laughs> e-bikers are getting all lined up with another mate in there, Chris Grant. Yeah, my bro, a couple of quick words before you kick off. How are you feeling? Oh, Tired? <laughs> Bored? Oh, hey? Awesome. We've got someone riding in this. Yeah, my bro, Chris, is representing the Husqvarna crew. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah boy! Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't look so nervous, bro. It's okay, bro. Yeah. You can do it. I'm gonna do it. Just a day out riding. Yeah. You just got a lot, a lot of people around you doing the same thing at the same time. Alrighty, and we're on. We're on. Wave two. Let's go, Jackson. Have a wonderful time, riders. Up you go. Have a great time out there. Yeah. Oh, I love that, that camaraderie at the start. So this is it, kicking off the 25 kilometer event for the Walker 100. Now, both of the boys had a brilliant day, that much was certain. I managed to get a bit of POV on both of them, uh, alternating as you'll see throughout the video. They also both took two different approaches. So Jackson was a little bit more reserved at the start and decided to conserve his energy throughout. Whereas Jason, I would say was a little bit more, not aggressive, but definitely a lot more confident, surging ahead and just really having a great time of it throughout the entire event. Great, gentlemen. Gotta love a professional doing his job well. Ah, excellent. So a slight change to the course because on our recon ride we actually went out towards Te Pokorupu. Now we're straight into feeder. Interesting little change there. And this wouldn't be the only change on course that we would experience. So we would eventually end up doing less than 25 kilometers overall. One of the other changes that we had was that once we got into Tikitapu Road, we then traversed down onto Jeff's Link and then into the first section of Toda. We would also end up deviating from Yellow Brick Road and instead heading along Sandy Skid Road straight away before traversing into Old Chevy. What's up, my boy? All good? Of all the people I've got to find in the forest, <laughs> I find another Mouldy out here. Uh, hey, you're right. hey, it's all good. I'm just, I'm waiting for the lads to come through. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah I've heard that before. Nah. <laughs> Casually cruising down Tiki Tapu Road with the bro up in front. This is quite a level section, and then it dips off and goes down. We're gonna pick up a little bit of speed. No, you're right, you're right. <laughs> Sorry to scare you. You okay? Oh, that's the one. Good stuff. Oh, who put a hill here? Okay, here we are on Toda. Just managed to catch the bro. Jace up. Jeff, I know. Well done. Good work. Todd Alexander. Yeah. Coming off the second section of Toto, we're going to be dropping into the forest. Get your pump and your flow on. <laughs> and watch the edges so you don't fall over. Are those your boys up front? Yeah, mate. Jeez, they're riding good, eh? Yeah. Sure, boys, you're doing fantastic, eh? Keep up the good work. One thing I need to really express about the event, in fact, any distance within the Waka 100, is that it always pays to, you know, be really, really cool out there on the trail. You never know who's gonna be, you know, in front of you. If they're a slower rider or whatever, if they lack experience, you know, just be cool. Because after all, at the end of the day, people wanna go away with a good experience. And I feel that this event is one of those really, really good ones that if you are positive out there, people pick up on that and they're, you know, they can tell that you're really happy about it. And if they're happy about it, they're more than likely to come back. They're more than likely to recommend people to come and join the event so yeah let's just all try and be real cool out there that's just my philosophy with it go Jay, go, go. Oh. oh i had to stop on that jason i had a little bit of an amateur on that log sorry bro <laughs> all good Woo! nice
Sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. Okay. Well done, young one. That was fantastic riding. Poplar Link. So it gives a chance to, <laughs> I suppose, mellow out and just uh, reset from the fun that we've had on Pura. Woo! Right, into old Chevy. <laughs> Thankfully, on the 25, you don't have to do a lot of it, just some of it. <laughs> Woo! Nice. Shot team. Good work. <laughs> Back in the game with Jackson. Carry on, man. Good old shot box. Not a lot of people can make the shot though. Bruh. The looks of it. <laughs> old mate lions. Five k's to go. Yeah, man. Suck it up. Oh, heck, the athletes are coming through. Hold on. Your what? What did he say? Oh. Your testicles. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. dropping into grinder. Ooh. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Nice, mate. Good work. We're about maybe less than two, maybe three kilometers from the end. Gonna head into the uh, rock drop link. Then we're done, you know, it's been a really good, uh, good day out on the bike. Looking forward to that end of uh, event bezies and collect that medal at the end. Go, 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 go. Here it is, here it is. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. This happened to be yesterday too. Rosebank, for those of you who are watching, that last little bit on the 25, it can drain the legs and forces people to get their walk on. And now we're gonna go up. <laughs> if you've got enough torque, you can get up. Oh, so much fun! Thread the needle. Here we <laughs> Listen to that vent buzz. Oh, so good. That creek jumps just down over there on Rosebank. You might be able to hear the hype and the people coming through. Man, it's going to be good, eh? Perfect opportunity if it's your first time, first event, whether it's the 25 or whatever, to hit that creek jump and get yourself a real steezy photo. Good work, Farno, good work. Look at all those happy faces, hey? Loving it, loving it. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. The end of 25 for Jackson. Let's do it. Let's go. Oh. oh Let's go! I just want to give a big ass shout out to the bro Danley Vince. He's the DJ here in the video. Not only is he a shuttle driver, but he plays the mad sounds. So go check this fella out, man. He's so cool to hang out with. I'm going to leave some links below to his SoundCloud so you can check out his sounds. Go support the bro because he's really, really cool. That would be mean as. Cheer my bro, Dan. <laughs> is he going to hit the wall ride? There we go. You're loving it. Good event. Oh, the, the best, man. You all got to get out here and do this. It's like spectators are awesome, but being part of the action is even better, huh? Absolutely. Totally. 100%. Love this stuff, bro. Ah, we love that you're part of it. Thanks for watching. Oh, gee. Ciao, <laughs> bro.
And there we have it, Fano, the 25 kilometer distance for the Waka 100. Now, I absolutely recommend the 25 kilometer as a bit of a starting point for your uh, XC journey, as it were. I mean, it's a really fun event. It's super, super organized, super, super friendly. There's lots of cool people around you. Pretty much once I finished my event, I decided I'm gonna go just chill and check out everything in the area. I had a good wander around, talked to a few people, you know, just tell some yarns and stories from the day. Decided to go down onto Rosebank and have a look at some of the people coming through along that creek jump there, especially some of the people who were doing 100 kilometer. Really impressive to see the top tier elite people coming through at such pace and it's just amazing to watch them just, you know, do their thing on the bike. Just like the 50 kilometer distance, which by the way you can check out in the links in the comments section down below, the 25 kilometer distance was also equally as good. I did manage to link up with uh, the bro Kelvin here from Totara Mountain Bike Park. He actually gave me a very quick summary of his thoughts of the day. Check it out. Now we've got Kelvin here representing Totara Mountain Bike Park. How are you, my bro? Oh, not bad, not bad. So yeah, what did you ride today, the 25? 25, eh? What are your thoughts about the day? Oh, awesome. Yeah. Well set up, well run. Um, the, the, you know, coming in the last couple of days, seeing how relaxed they were because they were ahead of the game with, with the setup, mm -hmm. and uh, just meant that everyone was you know, so happy happy with the weather. What's your sort of advice uh, to anybody who's looking to perhaps enter the first their very first 25 event? Go for it. The tracks are, are challenging. They um, are not unachievable for a, for a first timer coming into race. I think that the climbing is, is is just enough to really challenge you, but not not enough to really Fantastic. really knock you. So out. overall, it's going to be a good experience. Oh, for excellent them. experience. Joe Kelvin, I totally agree, bro, and thank you very much. Thank you, Fano, for watching. Consider liking and subscribing to my channel, and here's hoping I see some of you in the 2023 Waka 100 event. Kakite.